E pessoal, se eu tiver mais um vídeo, hoje é irmã, já é gira, Yuta Okatsu, Raina das Madisoi, by Markham, featuring Annie. I know I am very late to react to this. However, it is better to be late than to never do it. <laughs> I'm excited, it's Markham. Markham is a fantastic artist, and it's featuring Annie. I don't remember a lot of what Annie has done. I don't remember any of the other songs that she has featured in. So I'm very excited to see what she brings to the song. So let's get into it. Beautiful writing and performance from these two. I love Markham's singing. I feel like Markham and Annie's voice, I feel like their voices harmonize so perfectly together. The way that Markham's voice is slightly lower and then Annie has a much more higher pitch and she has a lot of power of her own. Their voices are perfect for each other so this is beautiful singing from both of them Mas essa história não distorça Não foi você quem me amaldiçoou Rica Me empreste sua força Meu amor And then that rock ballad as the chorus. This is such a twisted love song, I feel like. It's the story of how two young people are letting their emotions get the better of them. <sighs> wow. I actually was not expecting this at all. I was expecting Markham to do his usual rapping. And then Annie as the chorus or something like that. But I love how this song is much more. It's just them two singing and it's just beautiful. I should, I, I, now I know why everyone told me to react to this and was upset why I didn't react to it. This is beautiful and I really should react to this sooner. Você não me amaldiçoou Prometo que vou viver para livrar você de mim Mas 
escola Jujutsu eu vou Tratarei meu melhor até o fim Não posso liberar lá, então vou embuir Energia amaldiçoada Na arma que me servia Não sei quem é você, não sei o que você quer Mas se você insulta amigo meu, aqui com o que vier Tudo que eu quero, não sabe com o chão Você vai me matar, tenho certeza que não Você devia proteger That is what I was expecting from the song. I was expecting Markham to rap and then Annie to add additional vocals to it. But I love the story of it all. This is the part of the story where Yuta tries to focus on himself. And that's when Markham starts to rap. That's when he starts to get aggressive. But then near the middle where Yuta needs Rika, it feels like, that's where Annie comes in. She has a more aggressive and gravel, a very guttural voice. And I really like this. It's a very flexible style and... I think Annie, she's contributing so much right now. And then, of course, you have to end it bittersweet. Because that's the thing about love. Love is amazing. It feels really nice to be loved by someone. But then, of course, when love starts to mess with you, when you start doing, when you start, when you don't think because you're in love, that's when it hurts you. So I love the ending. I love it how it's just the two of them accepting that they both just love too much and they may have hurt the other person when they didn't want to. So beautiful, beautiful song from both of them and just a fantastic showcase of both of their talents. I know Markham is extremely amazing. His music is just some of the greatest I've ever heard. Annie, though, I know I've heard of Annie in a lot more songs, but just because I react to a lot of different songs, my brain doesn't remember them. But I love her performance in this one. I love how she has a beautiful singing voice, and then she has this really intense, guttural voice. And then she can just do a very powerful, emotional uh, song, too. So... Really amazing uh, song from both of these people. So I'm really happy I finally reacted to this. And I'm pretty sure there's a lot of people who are finally relieved that I reacted to this. So thank you all so much for watching. Please let me know in the comment section down below on who else I should be reacting to. Until then, obrigado por assistir. Super ordinary. Audi.